What's up, peoples? Welcome back to See These CDs, where in each one of these videos, I take a closer look at a select CD from my own personal collection. Uh, if you haven't already figured it out, today we're going to be checking out uh, Rihanna's uh, 2016 CD, Anti, uh, which more specifically was released uh, January 27th, 2016. Um, it clocks in at just over um, or you know, around 43 minutes and 36 seconds. Um, it was released under Westbury Road and Rock Nation. Uh, you know, Rock Nation being, you know, Jay-Z's, uh, you know, label. And Westbury Road apparently is uh, Rihanna's label. But, you know, everybody got to have a label nowadays. Understandable. It's a smart decision. Um, the, uh, let me see. Uh, all right. So, Roy Natchum, um, he's an Israeli-born artist. He's the one who, you know, did the whole packaging uh, as far as, like, the design, the album cover, the artwork. Uh, it actually stems from his own... Um, uh, some of his own like work essentially um, it's uh, I, I guess it's like this like blind series um, he actually talked about uh, you know um, in an article I was reading uh, when he was actually you know going in detail as far as like you know what it all represents that's actually like a picture of Rihanna and just in case any of you guys are confused you know well, I'm referring to the front cover but uh, just in case any of you guys are confused um, it's not you know my camera not you know, being able to focus, it's, you know, actually, you know, like that where it's kind of blurry uh, around the arms, and it looks like, you know, uh, like, I guess she's she's not necessarily centered, or the image isn't centered, uh, so, you know, just to clear that up, but that is a picture of Rihanna, the crown, you know, over her eyes, he was saying it symbolizes, um, I guess, like, not understanding that you're here, um, in, the, in the sense that, like, you know, always seeing uh, success, always wanting success, rather, and, you know, being driven to obtain, uh, you know, more success while not understanding where you actually may be at the time. Um, so, yeah, I mean, you can check that out. It was pretty easy to, you know, find. Uh, once again, the artist is Roy Natchum. Uh, he's Israeli born. And um, I guess he was introduced to Rihanna by Jay-Z. So that's, you know. Uh, something else interesting. Um, I don't. Yeah, you should be able to see in the in the shot as well on the cover. Uh, there is Braille, but yeah, it's actually a poem by uh, Chloe Mitchell and uh, Roy Natchum. Normally, will you know do this with his artwork. Uh, it also, you know, it, it's pretty cool because it allows like you know the fan to interact with the CD case. And you know how I talk about that before in the packaging. Uh, how I really you know like appreciate that because it kind of like takes a step outside of just being like a visual piece of art, and it you know it really. Um, you know, conveys the message that this is, like, tangible. You're taking something home as opposed to, like, you know, downloading, like, an MP3. Puts an emphasis on purchasing, you know, the CD or, you know, the artwork. Um, but, yeah, normally Roy Natchum will just, like, write a poem and he'll put it in Braille. Um, and, you know, he says it puts an extra emphasis on the whole idea of it, uh, being blind. It's conveying, like, another message. It's, like, you know, artwork within the artwork, which I thought that was pretty dope as well. Um, so, uh, yeah, I mean, we can take a look at a uh, CD cover. I'll bring it a little bit closer. This is like the deluxe edition. So it's, it's higher than your normal CD. Um, I'll use this lock CD because we are, I'm sorry. I, uh, messed up yesterday and I, once again, I, I, I was watching the Celtics game, game two. They took it. That was a pretty impressive game, but I fell asleep toward the, uh, last quarter. Um, and then, you know, I was supposed to do the videos like afterwards, but I'm going to use the locks because, you know, that's going to be the next video. I'm going to do another, uh, double video day, uh, cause I want to keep consistent. Like I was saying before with, you know, the, the amount of videos I upload, but I just want to bring it closer so you can see since the locks is like a standard CD case. Uh, you can see this one's a bit higher. Uh, it is like, uh, you know, the, the paper or the cardboard folding type of CD. And, uh, yeah, I'll just bring it a little bit closer, drop it so you can see the top of it. Like I said before, it's a picture of Rihanna. Uh, apparently, she's holding like a balloon in her left hand, and that's a crown over her eyes. And there, I think, yeah, there's more. There's more uh, Braille over the uh, the crown. If you could see there, trying to clear a shot. Yeah. And then, uh, yeah, if we open it up, it's a uh, it's a threefold. Um, it has three different panels. Uh, first, I'll go to the back so you can check that out. Uh, for the majority, yep, that's you know the back of Rihanna, which that's pretty interesting. I wonder if that's an authentic picture of Rihanna, like if that's actually her, because I would wonder like how would they have like a 3D shot of her, unless they had multiple pictures they were pulling from. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty interesting. We got the barcode right there, just in case you want to see that. Don't know why you would. I don't know what that necessarily is, like why there's like this like white uh, sticker, but you know the braille's continued on there, so I guess it you know it's purposeful. And then there's some small number right there. Try and get that in focus if I can. It stops swinging. I only have two arms, people. 
Two hands. The man with two hands. I don't even know why you guys need to see this uh, number, but whatever. Uh, we're going to keep moving. And then in the back, it, it would seem to be, uh, you know, like some of the, the Braille uh, lettering or characters, but, um, you know, just uh, enlarged or blew up. Um, for the most part, the theme of the CD, as far as, like, color goes, it's just, you know, white, black, and red. Um, and it looks like there's some uh, fingerprints around the uh, the Braille, which I'm assuming would signify it's, you know, it's being red or it's been red. Um because, you know, that's how you read Braille. Um, and, yeah, uh, if you want to turn it over on this side, uh, each one of these panels, it's it seems to be like the same image uh, with kind of like a, a Baroque style. But I don't think that is Baroque, but Baroque style frame. Uh, just my only, like, frame of reference. Um, but, yeah, there's a frame, and then within it is, you know, the the Braille, which you can actually feel. And I'm sure you could read. I believe it's the same poem. Um, and then, you know, as we go... Over to the next one, it progressively gets more, uh, I guess, like muddied with like the fingerprints into the last one where it's, you know, it's completely covered. I mean, I'm assuming that just signifies, you know, it's being read, uh, popular poem. Uh, but yeah, so on this side, you know, there's this pocket right here. Uh, that's where you have, ooh, I should say that one for the last. All right, so yeah, there's that pocket. There's like a booklet in there, uh, but we're going to, you know, come around, you know, to that at the end because that's pretty dope. Um, but, huh. Actually, no, no, no. Let's 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 take this booklet out. I think I'm okay. Yeah. So this this book this booklet is actually pretty dope. Let's go to the CD first, really quick, before we jump into that. Uh, cause the booklets it's it's basically just like a booklet of like pictures. Um, so like you know, I guess you can look up the credits like you know elsewhere. Um, I don't believe there was any credits in there, but you know we'll confirm that in just a moment. CD is pretty basic. Uh, it's just a white cover uh, with anti and you know interesting like typography at the bottom in black. You know basic yeah just black uh and then the back I'll show you that it's pretty basic once again uh I'm gonna slip that cd right back in there it's pretty snug fit i'm pretty sure that's the pocket it goes in i can't imagine what other pocket uh that one would be used for but yeah so uh the booklet the front cover like i said it's just it's like a collage of like rihanna pictures it looks like it's all from one photo shoot um it stays pretty much with that you know color theme like i was mentioning before we incorporate a little bit more uh grays blues uh, but it's all around, you know, similar hues um, as, you know, uh, that, like that white, black, and uh, red, like I mentioned before. Uh, like I was saying, there's more collages. This is all pretty dope. Uh, you know, it just adds to, uh, you know, like what you're taking home. Like I was mentioning before, it gives you more of like a, a visual idea or concept of the CD. Um, yeah, and it just adds to the music. I'm sure if you were looking at this while you... Uh, you know, we're listening. It may, you know, add to the the effect or give you a better idea of like what she was trying to convey, um, or at least it'll give you something like something to, like think about. You know, like if you listen to it like 50 million times, you know, I I, I really enjoyed the CD. To be honest, when it came out, I went you know saw her on tour and everything. She came to TD Garden. It's pretty dope, um, and I, I enjoyed you know see this is my first like Rihanna CD that I really got into and uh, I enjoyed the music. I haven't really listened to too many before this. Um, but yeah, no, I, I definitely think it's fitting of the whole vibe of the album. Um, it's been a little bit since, you know, I played it, but because I'm, like I said, it came out in 2016, but no, it definitely, you know, fits pretty interesting pictures. Uh, I think, you know, this, uh, these two pages, I think would go more with, um, you know, Roy Natchum's work in general, uh, with that, you know, like I was saying with the whole like, uh, blind concept, uh, that he, you know, he goes with, uh, from piece to piece. Um, then there's, you know, more hands. I mean, I would assume, you know, the hands are included because that's what you're using to read the Braille. Um, but, you know, it can, it's open air interpretation. Who knows? And this is more similar to uh, a page or two ago. Um, so I don't think this is going, I don't believe it's going in any kind of order. Maybe, like, you know, you guys will see an order. Let me check all this out. Because um, maybe, you know, it just dawned on me it could be telling a story. You know, maybe that's why it's like panning back and forth and see like this is more like close-up shots of kind of like what we already saw um but yeah pretty dope see all that get that on in the chat and uh yeah more of these uh collage pieces it's pretty cool all right so like I wanted to save uh, the best piece, so, you know, I thought it was dopest for last. Uh, Y'all already know I don't 
like to really like hang on posters like that. I'm gonna put this book little away first, even though it's pretty cool. You know, with being out, um, it's a pretty dope booklet that does not fit in that way. I don't know what's going on. All right, there we go. All right, so yeah, this last piece is pretty dope. Like it's just a big ass motherfucking poster. Um, and it's basically a big, you know, a big poster of, of the front cover. Um, you know, where he said it was done by Roy Natchum. Uh, I'm going to try my best. Matter of fact, I think I'm going to take the camera up so I can get a good shot of this. So, uh, let's get a little focus. And, all right. So, yep. Uh, like I was saying before, it's a huge shot of the front cover you know you see the entirety of the balloon up there and uh if you get a little bit closer or you can see some you know you can see the braille which is that poem that we talked about was done by uh chloe mitchell uh flip around to the back which you know it's just plain uh you know white background black text uh and this is the poem uh, i believe that you know is in braille um that was written by chloe mitchell um, it's, it's all over the internet, like, you know, so you can definitely look this up, but just in case you just want to read it here, trying to scroll down slowly, in case anybody wants to check it out like that, pan on a little bit so y'all can see it all, and then we got the signature by Rihanna and Roy Natchum at the bottom, which I'm not sure why, uh, Chloe Mitchell's name isn't featured there, but yeah, um, that was uh, Rihanna's anti, um, the you know deluxe edition CD. Um, you know, overall I thought it was pretty dope. Uh, like, there's a lot you know to this. I think that's because you know it's probably one of Rihanna's biggest albums. Um, I I think you know she her sound you know transformed a little bit on this you know as well. Um, so it's definitely understandable that she put as much love and attention, uh, or you know hired the people who were gonna put the amount of love and attention needed. Um, into, uh, you know, like a CD like this, but yeah, this is see these CDs. Thanks for checking out the video. Uh, you know, there's going to be another upload, uh, you know, with this video, the locks, like I said, uh, because we missed the video yesterday. So like I said, thanks for checking this out. Uh, keep checking this out, you know, uh, throughout the week and, uh, yeah. All right, people. Peace. I'm out.